Greetings, my fellow Earthlings. It's an absolute pleasure to share my astrophysical insights with you once again, and today we'll be discussing a topic that's been a hot debate for decades. The comparison between Marvel's mutants and DC's metahumans. Who among these two groups is more powerful and has the most potential? And most importantly, who would emerge victorious in a fight? Well, grab a cup of coffee and fasten your seatbelts as we explore this exciting subject in depth. Firstly, let's dive into the world of mutants. Marvel's mutants are unique beings that possess a genetic mutation that grants them special abilities beyond that of a regular human. These abilities can range from superhuman strength and agility to telepathy and energy manipulation. Some notable examples of mutants include Wolverine, Cyclops, and Storm. On the other hand, DC's metahumans are individuals that have gained their powers through external sources, such as scientific experiments, exposure to radiation, or mystical means. Examples of metahumans include Superman, The Flash, and Wonder Woman. So, who's more powerful? It's challenging to make a direct comparison between the two groups, since they possess vastly different power sets. Mutants' powers are often more varied and unique, but they usually come with limitations, such as requiring a source of energy to use them or having a physical drawback. Meanwhile, metahumans' powers are more straightforward but tend to be more potent and limitless. In terms of potential, mutants have the upper hand. Since their powers stem from their genetic code, they have the potential to develop new abilities over time and evolve their current powers. In contrast, metahumans' powers are often fixed and cannot be altered. Now, let's talk about a hypothetical scenario where mutants and metahumans go head-to-head -head in a fight. For this scenario, we'll pit some of the most powerful members of each group against each other. On the mutant side, we have Jean Grey, who possesses telepathy and telekinesis on a cosmic scale. On the metahuman side, we have Superman, who has super strength, invincibility, and heat vision. The fight begins with Jean Grey using her telepathy to enter Superman's mind and attempt to control him. However, she quickly realizes that Superman's mind is too powerful to control, and he resists her attempts. In retaliation, Superman unleashes his heat vision, but Jean Grey uses her telekinesis to create a barrier that deflects the beams. The two engage in a battle of wills with Jean Grey attempting to overpower Superman's mind while Superman tries to break through her telekinetic barriers. The fight continues for several minutes with neither side gaining the upper hand. Finally, Jean Grey uses her cosmic level telekinesis to lift Superman off the ground and into the air. However, Superman uses his immense strength to break free of her grip and launch himself at Jean Grey. She attempts to stop him with a telekinetic blast, but Superman withstands the attack and delivers a devastating punch to her gut, knocking her unconscious. In conclusion, both mutants and metahumans have their unique strengths and weaknesses, making it challenging to determine a clear winner. However, if we were to pit the most powerful members of each group against each other, it would likely be a close battle, with either side having a chance of emerging victorious. As always, science and imagination have no limits, and the possibilities for these epic battles are endless. Thank you for joining me on this cosmic journey, and until next time, keep reaching for the stars.